All right, time right now, 718. Michelle joining us from Good Day State Line this morning. A lot going on. There's always a lot going on, though. Yeah, we love this. And you're keeping us posting a lot of Hollywood news right now, a lot trending right now. Yeah, so the biggest pop news story for the year, I guess. I was going to say this week, but it's <laughs> yeah. only been a week this year, uh, is the possible Kim Kardashian and Kanye West divorce. And I say possible because even though reports came out earlier this week that they were getting a divorce, neither one of them have actually confirmed or denied this. Right. And so it's... Kind of up in the air. I feel like people have been talking about this for a while mm -hmm. since you know Kanye was you know had some news last year. So I feel like this has been in the news, but yes. this is the week that people are like, it's actually happening. Right, reports are. right. And the, the reports are that they are separated, but the actual divorce we're still waiting to hear. Though there is a rumor that Kanye was involved romantically with YouTube star uh, Jeffrey. Um, Jeffrey Star, that's what I thought. Jeffrey Star, I just want to make sure I said the right name. Uh, but that has been shut down, so they have said that that is not happening. He, Jeffrey Star actually came out and said no. Uh, so we are still waiting to hear exactly uh, the details on the divorce, but we'll probably find that out in the next couple weeks, I yeah. think. So we'll see. I, I honestly we'll feel bad that all of their information is out there. I know that that's how they've been. Yeah, their well, money, especially if you think about the, like, it, the Kardashians themselves, they literally kept giving us their information I just feel like for years. So even no matter how much money you have, it's still like a divorce is so hard. Yeah. You know, I just feel bad for them. We'll have to wait see what's going yeah. on with that. Demi Lovato, uh, she has spoken out this week about what happened in Washington, D.C. She said that she is working on new music based on what happened. Quote, in the studio working on something special after today's assault on democracy. So we'll have to see what happens with that. A lot of artists, uh, you know, we talked about Ed Sheeran releasing a song yeah. with no album at the end of 2020, right. right before. So I have a feeling that might be what's happening here, where she okay. might just release a song and no album attached okay. to it. Yeah. So we'll have to see. And I wanted to end... Friday's pop news with a cute baby. We love this. Oh, you good? This everyone, good. everyone okay with that? So we've behind. had a week, Aww. and we're gonna have this cute baby Aww. to end pop news this week. So get this. It's uh, her name's Whitney. She was a pro on Dancing with the Stars. The baby's name is Kevin Leo McAllister. One letter separating him Stop. from Kevin McAllister, Home Alone, oh, but he is going hilarious. by Leo, as you can see Aww. right I love there. That name very cute. cute. So cute. <laughs> Look at the little bun. It looks like a little burrito. Yeah, it's very, very, very cute. So <laughs> wanted to end the week on a high note. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're also asking our Morning Mug Club this morning. Uh, family video closing nationwide. Can you remember the last video you actually rented? I really had to think deeply about this. Do you have your answer? I'm going to tell you later. <laughs>